Hey guys, make sure to check out Flyaway Simulation. It's got loads of great stuff, including freeware downloads for FFX, the latest aviation news, forums, and a whole lot more. That's flyawaysimulation.com or just search Flyaway Simulation. Hello and welcome back to Jack's FSX videos. Today I'm going to be showing you an active volcano in FSX, which is really cool to look at, um, simply because, you know, it's just something you don't see a lot, especially in this game. Uh, well, especially in real life, to be honest, but... Um, I'm going to be showing you this, so I'm in Hawaii right now. Uh, I'll tell you the exact location, uh, all of the uh, latitude and longitude will be in the description. Uh, and then just set your date to the 6th of August, 2000, uh, sorry, <laughs> 1983. Uh, 6th of August, 1983. No time of day uh, really matters. Uh, dusk is best though, but it's still alright during the day, like here, and uh, just basically fly ahead, you don't need to be at a certain altitude or anything because you can see it at any point. <laughs> So, if you just move over to the right, there it is. Uh, so, like I said, this is Hawaii. Uh, the oh, can't remember what the main island's even called. Um, I can't remember. It's just it's just the main island, basically, of Hawaii. Let me just get my mouse out of here. Um, so you can see right now, it's sort of just uh, it's just got ash, pretty much, just coming out of it. But just a second ago, you saw like like it's just doing now some uh, lava coming out. Uh, it's just this one bit here, it's not uh, anywhere else in this area. It might be some other, in some other place of Hawaii. I'm not, I don't know where any of the volcanoes are in Hawaii. Um, or how it works or anything, but that's basically it. So now the ash is gone, it's just lava, so it just sort of changes between that. And it's pretty cool, to be honest with you. Uh, especially how they've done it, like it's only available at that specific time in history. Like if you go went to it, if you set the gate to the 6th of August, 2084, it's not going to be there, you know, or like 2016. It has to be 1983. Uh, so I'm just going to get closer to it. Get as close as I can. Well, I, I think I'll just go through it, to be honest. Because uh, it obviously won't really matter. But that's actually an interesting thought. I wonder if, if, my re if I turn my realism settings up to max, I wonder if this volcano would break the aircraft. Like it would just say like it would just do what it normally does like when you hit the water and stuff it just stops the game uh, and then we'll get a look inside as well so you can see that there's like a little rise there um, around it uh, which is different to the rest of it see the bits coming off it, ash and lava and all sorts just coming off right there But this is pretty cool, I've got to say. I mean, look at this. Yeah, so it just so it seems to sort of change between the two, lava and uh, ash, and goes um, in a circle, basically, like that. Just a tip, if you want to find some more volcanoes, uh, if you just look up on Google, uh, like, significant volcanoes, basically, look at the dates and locations and then most of them will be there surprisingly uh, it, it, it does sound a little bit weird the fact that they've put in the all these volcano gates and stuff but if you just look up significant volcanoes go to that place set that time and um, that that's pretty much it really uh, now when I look this up it did say to try it at dusk so I'm now just going to try that for you okay so this is it at dusk uh, it doesn't really look much different but I think it's just because uh, the sunset there is going down over the mountain. I think that's only the reason it was said there. So, um, got to say, this is really cool, uh, and I suggest you guys go and have a look. So, thank you for watching. Remember to check out my other tank channel, Tectonic. More videos coming out on there. And I do plan to eventually uh, sort of phase over to Tectonic, so I will start releasing FSX videos on there as well, because obviously, I don't want to just leave you guys, but. Um, uh, yeah, so go and subscribe to Tectonic, more, video <coughs> more videos coming soon, uh, and you can suggest them if you want, so thank you for watching.